introduce yourself real quick. What's your role these days? Um, hi, I'm Danielle Malagari. I am helping out. I'm the assistant coach for the U20 Spirits um, Super Y, and I'm also one of the commentators for the live webcast for the, the full pro. Okay. Uh, well, how do you think the team's coming together so far? Um, right now, it's a little bit iffy with the U20s. We have um, we have a lot of kids that are here trying out, but we don't know exactly if we're going to be able to sign them because if they're quality enough, they're going to be going up to the W League. Um, you know. <laughs> At that age, because just because the numbers are a little bit low right now for the W League, so we have some kids that can do both the U20s and the W League. Um, maybe a couple weeks into it, they can be dropped down to us uh, and play more a little bit on age uh, with us. Okay, because their temptation say, "Don't look too good in front of Mark." Then you're <laughs> yeah. gonna play for. You're uh, not yeah. gonna play for yeah. us. Yeah. I mean, we wouldn't be doing our jobs as, as coaches if we ever said that. But you know, yes. if, if they're capable it's tempting, of playing, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> if they're able to, if they're capable of playing at that level, um, then you know what. Mm -hmm. We're happy for them. So we're just going to keep getting players out here and taking a look at them for the next couple of weeks before our games. Okay. Any players here today or coming up that you're particularly excited about? Um, there's a there's a good amount of kids that, that we are excited about. Only, like, I think three or four of them that were here today are probably the kids that we're going to be signing. We haven't really reached out to them yet just because we have so much time before mm -hmm. our first game. So we don't want to jump at them right away. Yeah. Um, so we're just going to kind of keep our options open for right now and then once we get closer to June 8th, I think, is our first game, we'll kind of be signing a few more players. Okay, yeah, June 8th for the U20s, I yes. guess, So, because I know the W League's like next weekend. Right, so, yeah, May yeah. 11th. Okay, so, well, how is it out there being, I mean, do you, do you really want to, like, get out there and play again? Is it oh, like it's, Is it more fun just to boss them around and say, do um, these stretching exercises? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> it's, it's funny because a lot of the girls that are here with the W League training with us, I played with for DC, with DCU for the last two years, um, and, you know, I've built friendships with them, so it's kind of different being on a different level mm -hmm. um, than them, and I don't look at them at as me being their superior, I'm a friend that is just looking at it from a different perspective. Mm -hmm. So it, it's fun. Obviously, anybody wants to um, get out there and jump mm -hmm. in with them, but I'm enjoying this role as well. Okay. Anything you want to tell fans to like come out and show up, you know, watch the W League games in addition to the spirit matches? Oh, yeah. I mean, Mark Parsons is going to do a fantastic job with the W League. He did a great job with the 20s last year, and he's on his way up, and I think he's going to put out some quality players and put on a good show for, for people. So I definitely don't count the W League out. I know the pro team is fantastic, but come out and support women's soccer in the lower levels as well. Okay, so how do, how do you get this commentary gig? <laughs> oh, okay. So uh, Chris Hummer called me two weeks ago before the first home game and said, Hey, D, you like to talk? Would you like to do this? <laughs> and I said, You know what? I think I can. Okay. <laughs> so um, I tried it out. I was a little bit nervous stepping into that role, but I think with my coaching experience, it's, it's really paid off, and I can definitely see it from a different perspective um, up there at the top of the press box. So it's fun. I'm enjoying it. Okay, sounds good. And you're going to do it today, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm going to go 